And I imagine one of the things they probably were happy about too is when you got your role to play the young Fran Drescher on The Nanny. That was crazy. So again, Aggie, she knew, um, you know, what I was selling even at a young age, well before I did. It's funny, again, I didn't learn a lot of things about myself into my 30s and one of them was, get this, that I'm specific. Literally, I was just like, why can't I be the girl next door? Like, I had no idea why I couldn't just, anyway. I sort of now, after Glow and the roles that I've played, I sort of see more what I'm selling. Though I obviously, personally think I can branch out much more than that, as I think most actors think about. Yeah. Um, that said, um, I was very nanny-ish as a kid, as I am now. And uh, Aggie got me this audition, and I booked it off the tape. And then they flew me out to LA. My mom came with me. And of course, at that point, couldn't have a full-time job because she was taking my little ass everywhere. So she takes me to, takes me to LA. And the night we land, the Northridge 6.6 .6 earthquake happened. We were staying in a motel by the airport. And our room was next to the pool. The pool cracked open. Our room flooded. We had to put all our suitcases up on the shelves, which were shaking. And my mom's friend, Jan, ran into the basement to get her car. And we were like, you're going to die. She's like, we'll have no way to get out of here if I don't get the fucking car. So it was like a, it was like an action movie when I was 12 years old, the first time I ever came to LA. And like, you know, from New York, that's what you hear about. Like, oh, there's earthquakes and all this. And you're like, that I mean, stuff I doesn't happen. I mean, and now I've lived here of 150 years and I've never experienced anything close to what happened the first night I got here. Wow. Did you know, because you know, you were young, like you wanted to work, like obviously being flown to LA was amazing, but like, did you know, like, this is Fran Drescher, this is the nanny, like, this is a big thing? Yes, I have chills as you're asking me that. Yes. So I absolutely, like, this was the biggest thing ever. The show was a massive hit. Yeah. Uh, sort of the opposite of when I did The Sopranos, because I did that first season, so no one knew what it was. So I'd be like, oh, I'm doing this show, The Sopranos. And everyone was like, do you, do, are, do you sing like soprano alto or what? Do you, and I was like, oh no, I think it's like a mafia, it's some mafia show, I don't know. Where the nanny, so I was excited about The Sopranos, but it wasn't anything yet. Whereas right. the nanny was like this smash and I was gonna be flown to LA to do this thing. The Sopranos, I just think I drove to Silver Cup in Queens and was like, hi, what do I have to do? Were you shocked then after like when that became such a huge hit or could you just tell like on set? No, I had no idea because I only did one episode. Yeah. And it was like, oh, I was, I wasn't shocked when it became a hit because you never know. But I was like, oh, whoa, people are loving this. And even now, so funny, I randomly get a text. People are just like, I finally watched The Sopranos. I watched you watch that girl try to kill herself. I'm like, what's up? What was it like to work with Fran? Like, and was your mother like freaking out just because I imagine the most yeah freaking, like and that's the thing like I think for my mom no, and I'm not trying to make it better because she gave up her life for me and I'm like she got a lot out of it too but truly she did I mean our relationship was unlike any other mother-daughter relationship I've seen it's like we're so close but it's not contentious and we don't bitch at each other I mean we generally just enjoy each other make each other laugh support each other it's just pretty dreamy and so you know, here she was flying to LA and being on the set of this TV show and, you know, getting carted around. I mean, it was, it was exciting. Yeah. I mean, like, did she get to meet Fran? Like, of that's... Course. Of oh. course. She has pictures with her. You know how it is. It's so, so exciting for her. 